Residents clear debris in this village on the front line in the Donbass, hit by Russian shelling. The target, they say, was a bridge used for transporting troops to Severodonetsk. The Ukrainian army has been fiercely fighting to defend a strategically important city in what is seen as a pivotal battle for Russia's offensive in eastern Ukraine. The Russians controlled about 70 percent of the city, but they were pushed back over the last few days. The city is now divided approximately in half. Which side has the upper hand is unclear, as street-to-street -street fighting rages on in Severodonetsk. Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky admitted on Monday that Russian troops have a numerical advantage, but said that Ukrainian soldiers have every chance of fighting back. Zelensky visited the neighboring town of Lysychansk over the weekend, which is also bearing the brunt of Russian shelling. The small industrial town will become a crucial defensive position if Severodonetsk falls, something which looked all but inevitable a few days ago. But Ukrainian authorities say their troops are clawing back territory as they continue to repel attacks in Donetsk and Luhansk. The two areas make up the Donbass, the region where the Russian army has refocused its efforts in recent months.